Hey folks, Bob Report Customs here. What we're going to do today is clean our tower fan. So what happens is the air is sucked through the back of your tower fan and expelled through the front of it. And these get filled up with dust, cat hair, and whatnot. So there's many different ways to clean these. You can certainly take them all apart, but let's face it, most people aren't going to bother. And as you can see, the dust and so on in there. So I'm going to show you the simple steps to clean this, just using a shop vac or a regular vacuum cleaner. So what you want to do is have your shop vac set up so it's actually blowing out. And what we're going to do is actually blow all the dust out from here, and then we're going to flip it around and blow it out from the back. We're going to do that a few times till most of it's gone. From what you can see from the dust on my floor, it's certainly working, so it's good to do this outside. Now, just by doing that for about 20 seconds, probably 95% of the dust is already cleaned out of it. And you can see the back also. Now, if you have one of these little attachments for your shop vac or your vacuum cleaner, what you're going to want to do is go over it like this on the front and back to suck up any remaining uh, dust on it. One last spot that you can check too is where the motor's at. So make sure you check this with it unplugged. What you're going to do is remove these two screws and it's going to be similar on different models. So this is where your motor's at. This is the top of the fans that way. As you can see all the dust caught in there. So what you're going to want to do is take your vacuum cleaner and just suck that out. This is nice and clean. So we'll reinstall this cover. And I'd give it a wipe down with a damp cloth. Again, make sure it's unplugged when you're doing this. So wipe down all the surfaces. And when I turn this on for the first time after it's being cleaned, I like to have it outside. That way, if there's any remaining dust, it's going to blow it out. And there we go. It's all nice and clean. Even the fan on the inside might be a little hard to tell on video, but it is really clean compared to what it was. And that's because of the power, the blowing power from the uh, DeWalt. So when you're taking the shop vac and blowing the air through it, it's a lot more powerful than what the fan's able to push through so it's able to blow up most of the uh, dust again you can take these apart but again let's face it most people aren't going to this probably gets 95 percent of the dust and whatnot out of the fan and literally takes two minutes to do again it's good to clean out in where your motor's at too again it was just two phillips screws you pop the cover off goes that way and kind of snaps out a little bit and then you just snap it in, put your two bolts in after you vacuum it out. Again, make sure it's unplugged when you're doing that. Anyways, just a short video on how to clean a tower fan. Again, this is a Seville Classics through Costco. We actually have five of these, so that's why we like to keep them nice and clean and we want something quick and easy way to clean them. And again, these uh, techniques will work on many different types of tower fans. Anyways, hope you found the video helpful. If you did, make sure to hit that thumbs up button. And if you have any questions or comments, post them below. Thanks for watching.